Thank you, Cam. Right now, three Beaver Dam firefighters are recovering after their hovercraft crashed during a training exercise on Beaver Dam Lake last night around 745. The latest update from the fire department says two of the firefighters were released from the hospital this morning. Now, the third had serious injuries and was taken by air flight for life. Excuse me, was taken by flight for life to Aurora Summit Hospital in Oconomowoc. He is still there, but is in stable condition. The Wisconsin Department of Natural Resources is now investigating. Rachel Perry talked with the DNR and has you covered on where their investigation stands now. Just about a half mile or so from shore, I'm told is Grape Island. And at about 745 last night, DNR officials tell me three firefighters using a hovercraft collided with it. Despite all three being injured, one seriously, I'm told they are all in stable condition. As of right now, we know the Beaver Dam Fire Department was holding a training exercise here at Tahoe Park using a hovercraft or airboat. It's essentially a boat capable of driving on land or ice. At some point, DNR officials say the boat with the three firefighters inside crashed into Grape Island. They're now trying to piece together how the crash happened in the first place. Uh, another challenge with these types of investigations is when they take place during the hours of darkness. Um, you have to really work pretty hard to, to make sure you gather all the evidence, you get good documentation, um, photographs, things of that nature. Dispatch audio does give a bit more insight into the chaotic scene. We just hit an island. Uh, Bono is injured. Uh, Tim is hurt his hand. Uh, I'm bleeding from the head. Uh, I don't know if they're doing a drill. I just heard the fire channel that 1285 hit an island and we have injuries. We're still trying to figure out more like the extent of their injuries and what factors played a role in the crash. But for now, reporting in Beaver Dam, Rachel Perry, 27 News.